everyone, Dragon Souls here, and welcome, welcome, before we get to the review, okay, before we get to the review of, uh, well, I'm not going to say what it is, just so you have to find out here in a second, but uh, before we get to the review of it, um, I just want to say to everyone who lives in the U.S. that celebrates Independence Day, that's right everyone, Happy 4th of July to everyone who lives in the U.S. Today is July 4th, of, uh, today is 4th of July, and um, to be ready for today's after, uh, today's, uh, this afternoon's stream, because and be ready to hear a lot of banging going on because last night my neighbors and I'm not talking about my next door neighbors and my neighbor upstairs I'm talking about the whole neighborhood the whole damn neighborhood my whole damn neighborhood last night shot the shot some fireworks off last night and uh, they're going to be doing it all day today okay all day today or, or Starting this afternoon, probably this afternoon, they're going to shoot them all off today, okay? And it's going to be doing it all night tonight for for a good while tonight as well. So, there's going to be two streams tonight, today. One for the night, and one for the day, and one for the night, okay? Now, um, so, be, look, be looking forward to hearing a lot of pow, pow, pow at the end, and... and on my on my on my mic so if you're hearing a lot of pow 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 it's not someone knocking on my damn door to be answer if they're knocking on my damn door I'm not answering that damn thing. Uh, <laughs> but yeah. Thanks for watching everyone. Y'all have a wonderful day and y'all have a wonderful and I mean a glorious wonderful fourth of July because I know I am pleased be safe. Don't try to stay home. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. That was that's the over. Uh, that's a reference from WWE. Uh, <laughs> I'm not messing with you. I'm messing with you. But seriously, have a good Fourth of July and be safe. Okay. Dragon Souls signing out, and I will see you on hopefully on the live stream this afternoon. Now remember always leave your comments on these videos or all my videos even gameplay videos let me know what uh, if i need to improve it if i need to uh, fix them up what okay let me know your feedback are very important as always okay and i know as always i will say this okay i just found out by one of my long time subscribers and his name, and he's not in trouble at all, is T Rat Gaming. Just sent me a, a, a just sent me a message and comment last night, and YouTube is so messing up right now. Okay, it's so messing up with with the comments, and you can no longer, okay, you can no longer send links to me. In, in, in my in my uh, in my in the comments below the video my videos anymore, you cannot do that. Okay, for some reason, I know uh, people have been sending me links to uh, porn sites and stuff like that. You know, but people like him or people like my subscribers can't do that. Okay, can't they can't send they can't send me not uh, not porn sites. I'm talking about. Uh, they can't send me links like uh, to people's like uh, to people's chat like uh, to people's stream uh, YouTube channels, you know, for me to check them out and subscribe to them, give them likes and show support and all that. And by showing support, what I mean by showing support, I mean by giving them their videos, uh, give them the videos to watch, a like. And subscribe to the channel. That's the kind of support I'm talking about. I'm not talking about that money, money. You know, I'm not talking about nothing like that. Okay, but seriously though, um, 
YouTube's fixed it to where if you put any links in your comments, they will remove it or they will hide it. Okay, I can't see it. I won't be able to see it. So whatever you do, a fair warning to everyone. If you're wondering why I haven't responded back to you on your comments, is because if you are putting links into your comments of my videos I won't be able to see them at all because YouTube is hiding them from me and so therefore do not do that if you want to me to actually see your comments give you a like a love and also reply back to your comments don't put them in there do not put any the links of any sort especially when it comes to YouTube channels do not do that, okay? In fact, I'm going to make a separate video about something too, uh, about something too as well. And it won't, be, it's not going to be no drama or anything at all, okay? It'll be about me talking about something else. Probably either be today, could be tomorrow, okay? No telling, but stay tuned for that, okay? Thanks for watching, everyone. Y'all have a wonderful 4th of July, and I will see you this afternoon. Do the like and so signing out. Hello everyone, Dragon Souls here and welcome, welcome to my first review of that's right. WrestleMania 37 <laughs> of 2020 uh, 2021. Um, I just got done watching part one, the, the just one, just one. Okay, it was three hours and six uh, three hours and six minutes long. Okay, um, <laughs> ouch, <laughs> ouch. <laughs> uh, uh, so there were some matches in there that was really it was, was kind of uh, was actually I can't deny it. all the matches in the uh, on the show was really uh, all that show was really good especially Bad Bunny um, who stomped uh, stomped uh, the Miz's ass. <laughs> was really fucking good match. Um, <clears throat> uh, there was some other uh, good. Uh, there was a lot. I can't hardly say. I uh, like a. Uh, I think it was a uh, AJ Style. Uh, yeah, AJ uh, AJ Style and and uh, and the other tall guy with his partner. You know who uh, was going up against a new day. Uh, for the tag team belts, uh, that was a pretty good damn match. Braun Strowman versus uh, 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 Shane McMahon. Um, for uh, for those who've been called uh, the match, he, he he said that was he he said that uh, he dedicated that match to the, to everyone who's been called stupid, you know. That was a damn good match as well. I really enjoyed that one. But most importantly, I enjoyed was when um, uh, Bianca Belair versus Sasha Banks. Oh, that was that was too fucking good. That was too good of a damn match. She took. She literally took, uh, they can, she kept using her hair again, again, uh, her hair against her. Okay. And, uh, and she kept doing it. She kept, at first she kept pulling on it and pulling on it. She's okay, here, I'll pull it. I'll, I'll come, I'll come out towards you. I'll bring it towards me, you know? And she was like, it's like, when she pulled it, she's like, get over here, you know? And it was just funny how they done it uh, and they were like, it was really good match and everything, but right at the end of it, she put uh, uh, Sasha Banks pulled her hair again, and she's like, she's like, okay, 
You want to use my hair against me again? Fine. Here, I'll use it as a fucking weapon. She goes off and she takes that and she takes it and whacks. I mean, hits around the ribs, makes a mark, and god damn, it sounds like a shotgun going off. <laughs> I mean, that referee is like, oh, he. He actually he holds it he holds his arm like oh like he felt like he really felt it you know and everybody's like oh you know I'm like I like god damn I like that's the same that sounds like the same thing that my mom did when when my brother cussed her and cussed my mom out and I don't forgot what words he said to her but it, it wasn't pretty. And she slapped the holy taste out of my brother's mouth. It was, I mean, it echoed through the whole entire house, okay? And it, may, it, it was enough to make my brother cry and run to the bedroom. And uh, my, my, my friend, my girl, my uh, Max girlfriend, the recognition robber's dad was there. He felt it. And I felt it. I was sitting here bawling, crying. My mom was like, Dragon, why are you crying for? I didn't slap you. I didn't know, but I felt it. And he's like, and her dad was like, I felt it too. <laughs> we all, me and mom busted out laughing because of, because of it. Like, he's like, he was like, remind me not to get you pissed off. <laughs> and I'm telling you, that that is what it sound uh, that what uh, Bianca Belair did with her hair uh, using it again Sasha Banks like she did at the last match uh, at the uh, before she beat her for the belt the women's belt it sounded like a freaking shotgun going off just like my mom did with my brother oh my god I even though I'm not I wasn't there. I can I can even feel it through through the movie. I can actually feel it after and just hearing it. I can feel it, and I'm telling you, this one of WrestleMania 37, WrestleMania 37 of this year, on this one so far, is one of the best. Uh, one so far and I will come back with another review after I get done with this too to let you know what I think about it okay <laughs> I'm loving it so far all right everyone well this is my second review for um, that's right. For rest uh, for WrestleMania 37, 2021. Okay. For disc two. Okay. Um. Okay, the first, first thing they had on there was the beauty, the beauty, and the beauty uh, of it all was uh, was uh, was a country singer uh, singing uh, uh, America, oh America, how uh, all this uh, stuff, which is awesome. Sounded she sounded really good. Well, I, she sounded a lot better than that first lady. Okay, on the uh, on this one. Okay. Um, Cold Open 101, whatever the fuck that is, and Walk the Plank, Walk the Plank, okay, now Walk the Plank, it, it had, um, um, Titus O'Neil and Hulk Hogan, okay, to start to show up, okay, now, um, 
here's where people I heard people got pissed off about, okay? Randy Orton versus The Fiend, Bray Wyatt with Alexa Bliss, okay? Now, I heard that a lot, a, a lot of people was on Twitter complaining and bitching about how uh, the uh, this match ended, and I didn't know what they was talking about. You know, I mean, I watched Monday Night Raw, and I found until I found out on Monday Night Raw, she turned again. Uh, that uh, Alexa Blitz turned against the Fiend, and. Um, And uh, so I, I thought, and so all of a sudden, till I see what happened, seen what happened, she called uh, Alexa Bliss actually caused uh, the Fiend the match, and then all of a sudden they uh, they they look at they're still doing a stare down at each other, at each other, you know, lights went out, and you can tell before the lights went uh, kind of went out, that's when the Fiend took off. Ran, uh, ran off, and when the fiend and when the lights came back on, there was not everybody was gone, and the the the, uh, uh, the box was gone, Jack in the box was gone as well, and everybody, I mean, they were all disappointed. The fans booed them. There was a lot of people in there, and the audience booed them, and everything else. You know, didn't know why, what happened, you know, why they ended it like they did, you know, but you know what, um. I was kind of disappointed in that as well, but at the same time, uh, I kind of understand why why they did it for. But uh, yeah, that was kind of uh, that message is kind of bullshit. Um, Bailey uh, Bailey knows best. They made Bailey look like a dumbass. Okay, they made her look like an idiot, and um, it was funny how they did it. You know, I loved it. Uh, so moving on to the next match, WWE, WWE Women's Tag Team Champion match, championship match, Nia Jax and Shayna ba Baszler versus um, Nia ja Natalia and. Tamina. Tamina. Well, um, to be honest with you, the match was pretty good. I liked it. I really did. I enjoyed it. Um, the next match, Zimmy Zayn versus Kevin Owens with uh, Logan Paul. Now. I'm not against Logan Paul at all. I know who the guy is. Okay, I don't know him personally, but I do know who he is. He's, I know he's a YouTuber. Uh, he's a, a popular guy. Okay, and I am not going to be jealous of this guy whatsoever. Um, but um, for them to sit here and actually say, I think they actually said on one of the wrestling shows that you're uh, Monday Night Raw or. Or Friday Night SmackDown, or or on WrestleMania, I'm not sure, but they said that he was a genius. He was smart. He's a genius. He's better than every other YouTuber out there. I don't think so. <laughs> I don't think so on that. Okay, I mean, he may be popular. Yes, he's popular on YouTube. Okay. And he's a great guy, you know. He's a great streamer. He's definitely a great streamer on YouTube because I've seen his game and his live streams before. So he's a great guy, you know. But when it comes to smarts, he is not that smart at all. He, he's not as smart as I am. That's for damn sure. Um, so I wouldn't go that far with being smart. And when some and some people came to me and sat there and said when uh, Kevin Owens gave him a stunner. That um, he he acted very well on that on that stunner. I watched him do that and gave and gave uh, Paul uh, uh, Logan Paul a stunner. Okay, you can tell by the way they did it 
Logan Paul had no idea he was going to do that. Okay, some people say, trying to tell me that Logan Paul uh, knew he was going to do it. It was it, they they performed it the whole the whole the whole thing was staged and everything. I don't believe that shit. Okay, I don't believe that crap. Logan Paul had no clue that uh, that he was going to sit here and get stunned by uh, by Kevin Owens. He didn't know it. You could tell by the, the way he looked. And the way he act, and the way Logan Paul acts when he did it when uh, act, uh, did when when he got stunned by Kevin Owens, he did not do he did not fall like all the others like like uh, Zim and Zayn when 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 the other wrestlers get stunned by Zim, by by Kevin Owens, they did not uh, he did not fall like they did. He fell differently, so you can tell by the way he and by the way he fell. When he got stunned, you can tell that was not staged. He was that was not performed at all. He didn't know and that he and that he actually knew all that he was going to get stunned or anything. That was not, uh, no, because when on the camera, they have him on the camera. They'll be like, "Why? Why did he do that?" And then they took the camera off of him after he said that because like they're like, "Why? Like, he didn't say what we wanted him to say." So, yeah. So moving on, uh, Rolling uh, Rolling Thunder. Don't don't get it. United States Championship match. R Riddle versus Sheamus. Now that was a damn good match. I watched the whole thing. I enjoyed it. Um. Intercontinental Championship. Uh, uh, what? Drum, drum, son, drum, drum fight. I can't even, I can't even pronounce that. That one they know. Biggie versus Apollo Crews. Now I got a problem with this match here. Okay. I have a definitely a problem with it. That was some bullshit. That match was some bullshit. Okay. People can sit here and say, "Well, it was a fair match," you know, that he that he being fair and square. That son of a bitch had help. Okay. When you have somebody, uh, when you can't beat the person, and you have to have uh, somebody bigger uh, bigger than you are. And stronger than you are to come in there and help you interfere and and help you beat some um, beat um, beat uh, uh, help you uh, win the match. That's not winning it by yourself, you dumbasses. That's actually uh, giving that uh, giving them a help, uh, some help. So yeah, that match that match was stupid. Uh, a legendary even uh, evening. Don't know what the fuck that means. Okay, moving on. Women, uh, uh, Raw Women's Championship. Asuka versus Bri uh, uh, um, well, uh, Ripley. I love that match. That match was a damn good match. That match was a really fucking good match. I really enjoyed it. Double or nothing. Don't get me started with that one. I have no clue. Un Universal Championship Triple Threat. Triple Threat match. Roman Reigns versus Edge versus Daniel Bryan. With Paul Heyman, Heyman, Heyman and and, and Joe and Joe and Joe uh, and Joey and Jim, no Jimmy Uso. Okay.
they could have done a better job. On that match, they could have done a better job. Roman Reigns is always having help when it comes to defending his championship belt. I know they're trying to keep uh, keep it on Roman Reigns and give it and, and try to give Roman Reigns a push and everything, but uh, they're not doing it right at all. And having uh, having Jimmy Uso or or one or somebody helping uh, helping Roman Reigns keep the belt and win the uh, win the match to keep the belt, that's not pushing it. I'm sorry. It's a stupid match. It's dumb. It really, is dumb. WWE needs to learn and needs to under, needs to be, figure out what to do because right now it doesn't look that good, especially on that pay per view that they had on that. Uh, overall, some of the matches on the second disc was damn good. I really enjoyed it. Rest of it is fucking garbage. Um. Now, as for the third disc, okay, the third disc is nothing at all. It uh, has something to do with Bobby Lashley versus uh, Money Not Raw. Bobby Lashley versus his uh, two guys that was joined, used to used to be with him until he turned against them. Um, and then the next matches it has NXT. And uh, the, uh, the the third man the third disc is uh, it's only like a, an hour and 20, 30 minutes or something like that, uh, with different matches where like from uh, Monday Night Raw, Friday Night SmackDown, or I think uh, Monday Night Raw, NXT, and SmackDown and whatever you know. Uh, I don't watch that shit. NXT, I don't watch that crap. I used to watch it, but. Uh, uh, I fell by, way behind, and then I just fell off and said, nope, I don't watch it anymore. I don't, I don't give two craps about it. It's just not that good to me. So the disc, the third disc, in the, in the third in the third disc of WrestleMania is a failure. Okay, I don't like it at all. But um, overall, I'm going to give, I'm going to give this thing, I'm going to give it, I'm gonna give this an eight out of ten. Okay, I'm not. I'm not. I'm not. I can't see and give it a five. And I can't give it a, a six, cause I, cause that's that's telling y'all I hated it. You know, this here I can't say that. Some of the matches, all the matches was on. on like I said before on this one was great. Half of the matches on this two is uh, okay. And some of it was okay. It was great, you know. But half of it was car. And some of it was garbage. And it could have done better. And so therefore I'm giving two thumbs up. Four stars. And a grand solid eight out, of, eight out of ten. Thanks for watching everyone. Y'all have a wonderful night. And a wonderful 4th of July. And I'll see you on the next gameplay. A Far Cry New Dawn. As for me. I'm gonna go to bed and get me some sleep because I took to my bedtime lessons and right now I am so wore out and I'm sleeping. Post your comments on this video. Let me know what you all think about this, um, this review and everything else you saw in the game on the video. If you enjoyed it, leave it let me know what you think about it. Okay? Thanks for watching everyone. You all have a wonderful night. Dragon Souls signing out.
whoa, 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 whoa.